straight. I'm, I'm Hi, alive. I'm Abby. I'm a senior. I'm Julie Wren. I'm a senior. I'm in Summer Hotonji. I am a junior. I'm Juliana, I'm a, and I'm a junior. And we're, we're from, from Mercy, Mercy High School. School. Snap, crackle, pop! That's what I like to hear. <laughs> Poets Against Dueling. Due to the declaration of vaping as an epidemic, the amount of anti-drug charts and posters has skyrocketed. We feel like these anti-drug initiatives are missing a key demographic. Teen poets, this, this is, is not, not a group poem. poem. This, this is, is an intervention. intervention. Bathroom stall poster is saying some of the grossest things in here are that vaping may work for the masses, but us poets cannot be swayed with your typical ads and slogans. Hugs not drugs is great and all, but does not account for teen poets high levels of angst. We are so, so angsty that we wear converse with our prom dresses. We wear vintage <laughs> AirPods with wires hidden by hoodies. Our addiction is the void. That our chokers match our eyeliner, so here's an alternative slogan. Who needs downers when you've got Sylvia Plath? Who needs uppers when you could read a book in a bath? Dear, Dear parents, parents, this may be tougher news than when your child asked you to attend a poetry reading, but your teen has not been taking a flash drive to parties just in case they get inspired to work on that novel. Peer pressure is not a concern amongst poets. If we wanted to fit in, we wouldn't write poetry or carry notebooks around so everyone knows we write poetry. <laughs> If we wanted to be like everyone else, we would just clap for poems. We need to be so different that we found three alternatives to clapping. Yes, honey. Mm-hmm. Amazing. <laughs> Our idols are not healthy athletes or form drug addicts turned musicians. Instead, they are struggling writers who did a lot of drugs. And with long dead poets as idols, it is apparent there are worse drugs than mango flavored nicotine. Opium, cocaine, speed, heroin, and lots of alcohol were as necessary to their processes as a pen. You can't hang up posters saying, don't, don't be, be like, like Poe, because literally every teen poet wants to be him. You can't say, you can't spring Hemingway's addiction into inspiration when he is quoted saying, a man does not exist until he is drunk. Making a poster that reads, Sarah Dessen writes sober would drive teens to the bottle. An effective poster would read, Stephanie Myers found inspiration from vaping. She would understand it's for the greater good. <laughs> Truly, vaping kills brain cells, and you need those to string words together. You can be an artist without always having to struggle. We will leave you with one last haiku. John Green does many drugs. Fitzgerald did none. Wink, wink. Poets, Poets don't, don't jewel. jewel. Thank <laughs> you.